My name is Leonardo Frigo and I'm a London-based artist. I'm from Venice, Italy, and I mainly paint on string instruments. I started playing violin when I was 15 years old, and after a few months, I decided to remove the varnish, the original varnish from the violin. I decided to remove the original varnish and to paint it with black ink. When my violin teacher saw it, he decided to show to other people and after a few months later, I had my first art exhibition. After high school, I moved to Venice and I studied art restoration. These studies helped me a lot to improve and to learn about new materials. Venice is the best place to be a young artist. I had a lot of opportunities to show my artworks and I did more than three art exhibitions every year. Every violin is inspired by a different story or biography. Currently, I'm working on a personal project of 33 violins and one cello. This project is inspired by Dante's Inferno. I spent more than one year to figure out the perfect uh, ink. I use, a, uh, I use a mix of five different inks because some inks are too liquid to use on the wooden surfaces. So I had to mix different types of inks with uh, varnish. To paint a violin takes between four and five weeks to paint and to finish one violin. I start from an unvarnished violin, have to sketch all the illustration on a paper and after transfer them on the violin with the nib and the black ink. Uh, after that, when the violin is painted, I have to varnish it and set up all the strings and the finger sport and other pieces. So it's a long process and it takes between four and five weeks. Mainly my violins are sold as art sculptures. Others are sold to professional violinists. So these violins are playable. In the past few years, I had exhibitions in Italy, Germany, France, England. Um, now that I'm working on this big project um, inspired by Dante's Inferno, in 2021 it will be the 700 years anniversary of Dante's death. I'm planning to finish my exhibition for that date and have an exhibition in Venice and Florence. I had the first part of this exhibition in London in Mayfair last March. When I was a teenager I tried to find a way to combine my biggest passions and music and art. After some experiments, I found a way to combine them in a unique art piece that are my violins.